Yo, what's up, YouTube Sports Spirit and back with another banger. Yeah, so nice. Um, I know I've been gone for a whole month, bro. Um, I know y'all always saw a whole nother video posted yesterday. Uh, I'm sorry for that. I had to delete it because it wasn't like right. I was like in the wrong for doing that. But make sure y'all drop a subscribe. And yeah, man, let's hop right into this banger, man. Let's get it. Hey, y'all, man. We got the dig right here, man. Um, Hey, let's hop into this banger, man. Let's get it. Let's go, man. Thanks. That shit recorded. Do we so in the building? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, y'all had to, uh, you know what I'm saying, like, make sure it was, uh, getting the audio, you know? Let's get it. Alright, that shit recording. Do we so in the building? Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Smooth skin so in the building, yes, baby drill in the building, Whoa. man. Simple. Simple. <laughs> Bro, why is he just staying there? Am I gonna post this this time, bro? Like, am I gonna post this? I, mean, I, I can't do my real They're intro because I was just year. doing my motherfucking laundry and shit. I got my boxers on right now. I'm in the house, shit. I'm at home chilling, nigga. So listen, bro. Where have you this video been, was dude? That's why I wanna know, bro. Like, what happened, bro? Not about me. I've been good, bro. I'm chilling, nigga. Every time you see me, I'm a, you know. It's gonna be like I haven't been nowhere because, bro, like shit, we connected, my nigga. Little do you know, you my little bro. Big bro, whoever the fuck you is. Gotta be a real nigga, though. No femboys. Yeah. No. <laughs> you know. Yo, so listen. Something has come to my attention today. Today is the first of the month of August. Oh, sure, I'm late to this day. And what, what actually triggered this video was a... a, a a 2K, um, a, a, some fucking 2K gameplay that they oh, had posted. Oh, okay, and okay, okay, no way, I know what you're talking about. 2K25 is about to come out, man. Um, if you guys want me to react to that, man, make sure you guys, uh, stay tuned for that, man, and I'll, uh, post that for y'all. Me to fuck off. And it put me in the mood to Sorry. just want to complain. So that man right. 25 coming out, too. A lot of y'all gotta understand, sometimes God take me away so I can really find myself away from the ethernet stuff because it's not me. Nothing on here is really me in real life. It's just images that I created on this bitch going crazy with y'all. But in reality, when you take everything away from that particular person who got all the clout, all the followers and was getting all the attention and all the money, that person behind all that, that's who you really want to yeah. get a chance to know. Because nine times out of 10, everybody y'all see right now online is just protecting their image. There's a lot of bullshit going online. One of the things I'm starting to notice, my nigga, the weirdo Hollywood pedophilia, all the weirdo shit that was going on in Hollywood is starting to transfer over to streamers and YouTubers. It's kind of even fucked up to even say you a motherfucking YouTuber in 2024 or a streamer. Because nonstop, all y'all been doing is getting exposed for being weirdos. Like, it's fucked up. That's tough. <laughs> I think I know who you're talking about. Every time I turn around, it's another nigga getting exposed for being a weirdo. Now, listen, I'm going to be honest with you right now. It is a very, very, very tough time. And by the way, I've been gone since October 2023. None of this weirdo shit has nothing to do with me. It don't got me. nothing to do with My me either. Energy, everything about me I've was not on YouTube. June. All y'all other motherfucking new age niggas can absorb y'all self in this. This has nothing to do with me. But let me tell y'all this, straight up. I remember I was dropping videos on my spiritual channel. See, a lot of y'all niggas is getting older. And shit is starting to click. I ain't gonna even say you becoming conscious because you still a bot. But shit starting to click. So a lot of niggas you used to watch is becoming weird to you now. A lot of niggas you donated to, a lot of motherfuckers you was just turning up with. You starting to really... Question them now. You starting to see through them now. Yeah, I feel you. When I dropped a video about, I'm about to use this for a, a quick example, real quick. Do we so in the <laughs> building, man? I don't know why I got my shit like this, but I actually it looks swaggy. It's kind of tough. It, it, it's tough. Don't steal my shit. So listen, yes, bitch, I made it up. Mines. Hey. So listen. 
I already hear niggas talking. Like, man, nigga, I can hear your ass, bitch. So listen, on my spiritual channel, I dropped a video about Lil Nas X in the past. And this is when he was twerking on the devil and doing all his little weirdo stuff, right? And I was trying to paint the picture and tell y'all he's planted perfectly to destroy kids. If you go to a Lil Nas X concert, you ain't gonna see nothing but film boys and trainees with thongs twerking and doing all type of weirdo shit, right? But when you go online, he was at that time was doing Roblox concert with kids. Fortnite concerts and shit, but no, no children fuck with him. Now y'all gotta understand what a plant is when they put in position to automatically succeed. The streams fake, everything is fake. But you looking at them like a god in reality. The nigga was planted literally to change the mind. How many of y'all motherfuckers back in 2018, 2017, you was probably 12, 13, 14? Probably 15. You grown as fuck now, and you don't want to have nothing to do with Lil Nas X. But back in the day, you was, yeah, you fuck uh, with him. That song was tough. Take my horse to, yes, sir. That, that, that It was tough, but like now I just seem like weird, bro. But what I'm trying to tell you is this. These weirdos are being planted, and it's starting to happen in the YouTube and streaming community as well. It's been happening. I remember I've been told y'all. I just ain't saying no names. And this video is not to target anybody. It's just the weirdo energy is starting to come over here now. So now y'all got to get gods back like the cancer guys. Who's not afraid to really give you a real fucking opinion. Because most niggas is trying to protect their image. Especially if you in these groups and all type of shit. Y'all got so much to lose. Because y'all know when groups crumble, everything just go bad. And a lot of y'all ain't even did shit. It's just y'all mans in them. Let me turn my mic. Nah, we can hear you perfectly fine, bro. Man, it took me five minutes to notice I needed to turn this shit down. I feel the, look, the vibe, you know what I'm saying? That shit's still loud. I ain't been on here, so I ain't gonna touch nothing. Damn, is you back? I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna really pause I just it started recording, my baby. Long. 17 minutes. All right, so listen. It's my girl. She just got back. But look. A lot of y'all got to understand this. Oh, then he got a girl and another girl, I think. Right now, on YouTube, I say this year alone, I don't know how many people has got canceled for the pedophilia shit. I know Dr. Disrespect, and then you got the oh, he naming Chris situation. Now, My nigga over there was with Mr. Beast. You should have been got rid of that fucking weirdo. Like, bro, y'all got to start drawing the line for people that don't want to be human, bro. Like, it is what it fucking is. <laughs> Just like when I dropped the video about Cooley Ray or Dang, Coy Leroy, whatever the, the whatever the, my nigga name is, I, that's my bro. I told y'all the little the little girl, the little nigga had uh, anatomy. Her whole body looked like mine, and I study anatomy. I study human anatomy so I could tell what is what. And at the time, I was deeply on semen retention, so I had a lot of energy on my no fab shit. I wasn't really on no lustful shit. So when I'm coming across beautiful ass girls, I see a beautiful ass girls. And when I'm coming across a nigga, I see a nigga. And I told y'all straight up in that video, bro, this bitch could be a boy. I told y'all she was an intersex. Speaking of intersexes, look up what just happened in the Olympics. Old girl got hit one time and quit because the trainee punched too hard. What the fuck is trainees doing boxing against women? I'm telling you right now, fem boys, trainees, all y'all niggas catching these hands if you ever come near me. You can be the prettiest trainee all time. I'm beating you up. If you ever put your hands on me, you catching these hands. He's. You catching them. One HP. I'm going I'm to leave you on one HP to give you a choice to go back to your normal state. Ooh, dang, I ain't going to completely get rid of you. I'm going to leave you on one HP so you can think. Oh. So you can remember who the fuck you are. You a man. But listen. Back to, like I was saying with Cooley Ray, I told y'all, bro, a lot of people coming around, I told y'all, by the time 2030 get here, life gonna be so fucking different, because now y'all got these new species, these new, I call them test tubes, but it's really a lot of deeper shit going on spiritually, but I, this is not my spiritual channel, so I ain't gonna talk about that. Oh, okay. But hey, you have these new this, type uh, of beings channel, bro. that's here, who don't want to be human, so they would call themselves. video and then come back. They be it. Um, bitch, 
all type of shit. They just don't want to be he or her. They want to be everything but that. What is he talking about? This consciousness about? didn't exist until what like 2015. What is he talking about? Um, bitch. All type of shit. They just don't want to be he or her. They want to be everything but that. This consciousness didn't exist until like 2015, 2016. Y'all know this? It's new. It didn't exist. Like, okay, drag queens and trainees probably been the, been the thing. It just wasn't pushed to the straight community. It was its own thing. But now, bro, it's like you got niggas in groups with them boys. Bro, these motherfuckers. Bro, I, like, bro, I ain't trying to get thrown off topic. I'll talk about that in a minute. But my nigga, these motherfuckers don't want to be humans. They trying to change the way a kid think. And what's the first? What's the first thing right these motherfuckers that. It, do? They send every, them to talk to kids. Every at generation. School. Every That's generation. That's the first thing though, they. Like I heard, it's gonna continue to be dumber and dumber, bro. That's why. I, that's why I was told. Do is sending trainees and drag queens to talk to kids at school. A kid can't make a. Ch All they want is V bucks <laughs> and Roblox to put. They don't. Bro, they, they're kids. My nigga. They're kids. Bro, I can't even remember making a real decision about anything when I was a kid. But you talking about you gonna come to a little kid and say, huh, you can cut off your motherfucker. Bro, that's a future school shooter, right? You just destroyed that motherfucker life. Now he ain't, bro. Your daughter? I want a dad. I want a penis. Bro, that's what? a. What? Bro, and this is what I told y'all. Some bro? of these motherfuckers be test tubes placed by planet parents to raise them as trainees. They don't even be their real kids. But we ain't gonna go there. Okay? We ain't gonna go there. But listen, what I'm trying to tell y'all is this. This energy is spreading throughout your favorite streamers and YouTubers now. They gonna tell you, oh, it's okay. It's all right. That's my bro. That's my best friend. I still support him. And this, and that, and that, and this. None of this shit is normal. It's all demonic. What's that word mean? It's all weird. Demonic? And it's all simply to keep targeting kids. Nothing has to do with your grown ass. To be honest, they don't give a fuck about us. If you ain't conscious, they definitely don't care about you. Nigga, you can kill 100 people. One conscious nigga is more powerful than you because that one conscious nigga can wake up a million people that's thinking just like me on the same tip. But listen, so let's go... To this YouTube shit now. You got streamers and YouTubers arguing about should a girl should be able to have a kid at the, or get married. And the other nigga talking about kids should be able to cut their body parts and do this. Like, bro, I'm trying to tell y'all niggas. And y'all think one both sides is actually going against each other when both is weird. Fucking weirdo energy, bro. Why are we even focused on little ass children? It's like now, people who did have kid-friendly content, y'all seem weird now because of them. People who used to just chill and probably play regular games that kids gravitate to. Now, it's like you gotta watch how you gotta watch what you say. You gotta watch what you do. Cause people now are starting to look at us YouTubers and streamers different. That fucking fake gay or humor that Biden Ross used to do, that's you can't do that no more. In 2020 fucking four. Because too much shit is going on. Facts. Don't y'all see this? By the way, bro. Listen, just like trainees. If you're a transgender. Bro, if I'm a god. I know y'all going through a lot. And I'm going to be honest with you. On my spiritual channel. I have helped a lot of people get through like suicidal shit. And I ain't even trying to be, act like I'm just this special person. I, I knew I've been in a position to where I actually help people from not dying. That's and good. A few that of you're... them was getting that's good backlash that you're helping and just your going... community. Like, you know what I'm saying? I want to be like, I want to grow my uh, my channel, man. Uh, probably uh, upgrade it a little bit and like help the community, man. That's what I want to do, man. Don't do shit because they was trainees. Now they go through spiritual shit too. Some of them regret it. Hey man, make sure I you even told y'all like, it's groups comment, that goes against the communities bro. because the communities has like nothing anger, to do with you know them. Saying? It's just to go to the kids. Most people make these decisions when they don't. It's just to go to the kids. 
Most people make these decisions when they older and they regret it. So imagine what's going to happen to the kids that they let them do this shit and then they get older. You know what I'm saying? She, she, she. That ain't going to be regretting They're going to just talk about, oh, past. it's okay. But they ain't going to never show the backlash, the, the deaths, all the surgeries, the, the bro, trainees is leading in suicide, all type of shit. It's like crazy, right? But listen, I can give all y'all y'all own planet, give all y'all superpowers and natural resources, y'all own planet. In a hundred years, the whole planet would be wiped clean. All y'all would be dead because y'all can't create nothing. Y'all can't create life. Y'all just take. And it's not all y'all, but if you're a part of that community, that's y'all. Same with little, whoever my man's talking about with little kids, 12 year old, 13 year olds, should be able to get married and have children and all this, bro. That's not normal, man. A, a little kid, have a, she don't have, she's not developed to give nutrients, vitamins to breastfeed a child. The child would die. She don't have, bro, she haven't even developed yet, bro. And these are man-made niggas be starting to talk about history, bro. This, this is why I'm spiritual now. I have to remember who the fuck I was and do my own research. Y'all man-made shit, y'all not like us. It don't have it don't nothing, got to, nothing do to do with me either. That's weird, bro. Not, My ancestors wasn't looking for no little motherfucking kids. Community. They was protected, and we was looking for them juicy-ass women who we know we can breed with. And the women was looking for them motherfucking warriors who they know can go out there and make shit happen. Nowadays, bitches is just looking for niggas who at home chilling, jacking off, got a lot of clout. Same. Fact, fact, That's facts. it. They just want a clout, nigga. You ain't even... To be honest, now, and I know I'm getting a little bit of off topic, you ain't even got to really... Like, bro, this is what I'm saying. Like, it's so easy now, bro. Every, damn, they're all the baddest bitches I know got a price now. You ain't even got to try now. Every bitch got meetups in their bios. It is some good ones out there, my guy, but it's tough out here nowadays. <laughs> Every bitch a hoe. All she want is a little bit of attention. That's it. You ain't even got to love her for real. <laughs> just make her take a few pics with her and just show her. That's, show that's so true, she bro. important now. But listen. Back to what I was saying before I end this video, man, a little ass girls, little kids, they not even developed spiritually enough to even take care of their child. The child will die without a parent or without formula or different shit. When a woman have a kid, she naturally need the nutrients or she probably unhealthy or something so she don't have the nutrients. But normally women supposed to have what they need to breastfeed to feed Why their children, Why do you keep on talking cetera. about that? Uh, younger kids don't have that naturally. Younger kids don't supposed to be doing none of that shit, bro. I can't even believe I'm even having this conversation with myself because I'm talking to myself. Bro. No, you're not. No, you're not. And by the way, the other nigga who was talking about cutting eight. <sighs> oh, bro. <laughs> I feel like he have to say that. He got to keep playing down the middle so his opinions could feel like something. But, bro, whoever this nigga is, I guess he going to be one of those ones. See, they look for big content creators like that that can keep their shit going. That's crazy. Because ain't nobody in their right fucking mind gonna let their motherfucking little brother or sister who, or kid in general even look at sex, even talk about it. I'm not having that conversation with a little ass nigga. That little piece of shit, I ain't even talking to him about no fucking sex shit or her about no. That ain't even a combo that would ever exist to a kid. They won't even be around or never see it. So when they be like, I'm having these conversations. And I'm doing this, and I'm, it's up to them if they want to do it. Who's having these talks with kids? Niggas that's already got the pedophilia shit in their blood. They not like us. Bro, I ain't gonna lie. He was speaking facts, man, but bro, that, that guy, that, that's a W, bro. That kind of just related to what I just went through earlier today, man. But anyways, man, um, I hope you guys like that video, man. Make sure you guys drop a subscribe. And yeah, man, I'll see you guys in the next one, man. Be out. Peace.